Yo right, guys, welcome back to Trading to Pink Marker. Right, so this is episode two. So hope you guys do enjoy this uh, trading series. If you do, make sure you guys do leave that thumbs up, subscribe if you are brand new around here. Now I do uh, trade up to team, uh, well, I always say team and decent rice, but I do trade up to uh, the the player that I always I always give out um, coins out on the Xbox. Well, say like Marco Royce out on the Xbox, and for, uh, so 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 it's fair. I give out coins out for the um, PlayStation uses as well. So I just saw at the beginning of the episode that we did um, on the episode one that we saw everyone previously. So everyone did sell because I always show you players that sell, and obviously that now. This is the method what I do. I just go and sell over whatever price um, I want to. So I see absolutely prices for nothing. And then I just put silver in. And what I do every every single time I find a player with a bid on, or say if it's like a rare player or a non-rare player with like a five hundred coin bid on, I always compare the price because you pick up some pretty insane deals doing it with that way. So we did a. Uh, Bid on quite a few um, of them plays now you see later on in the episode that if we did win them or not so yeah like I keep on doing is just keep looking through um, these silver cards because we do see a team of the season with a bid right there for 35,000 coins now that was like 22k or something like that. I would put a bid on them but as the banks put a bid on the knocks so I could make like 1,000 coins maybe 2k but I was thinking now that there's no point because I could build like three players worth like nowhere near um, the team is using the price to make more profit on that, so that's what you need to do when you when you're um, trading. So we did see this guy here for 400 coins with a bid on him, and then he looked pretty insane. But he, he starts looking really crap because he has because he has high physical people wanting him in his team. So we did lose that this man there for 1.7k. That was really unfortunate because he I think he's on about 3.5k, maybe 4k. So then we do go back, and obviously I stopped recording to show you preview. But um, obviously that. Obviously, I'll stop recording and I go and put a bid some more players. So we did pick up this sucker here for 350 coins. That was a pretty sick deal for 350 coins right there. And also, we, uh, we did pick up quite a few good deals. So we did uh, list up this sucker here for, I think it's about 1.2k, maybe 1.6k. Uh, make of, uh, well, we're, ba we're basically um, triple our coins on it. So we're, I think I think it's about 1.6k, there's 1.6k. And he did sell instantly. Now, I've actually never ever used sucker on this game. He starts up pretty insane. So we did pick up this Manu here, right here. I was thinking if it's a good deal or not. 300 coins, next stupid up is 5,000 coins. I mean, that's like, what happens if we got 300 coins, making five, make about 3.5k profit on them, so we do that on the cut people, so people can buy their players instantly, or buy our players instantly. That's a, um, you know, a good trading uh, uh, trick. It's always on the cut the people by maybe a K or two. So you've got a massive player, maybe like a 100K, but like these like cheap uh, players, just on the cut by one and a half K, and they'll instantly go for yours straight away. I don't know why, because it's, it's only one and a half K, but say people that have uh, much coins, it's a really good method to use. So yeah, we did pick up uh, a Tony for the thing about 350 coins, and he sells it. He sells really fast. I don't know why. He's actually a good player to trade with because he's got really bad stats. But people love using him in silver teams because he's got really overpower heading. So we did pick up this um, this left back here for 1.6k. We did uh, triple our coin. Oh no, we did double our coins on him. I've actually never ever seen him on the game. But obviously I don't really use silver people because I have a lot of coins. I always use expensive people. Now they pick up the Scarrow Hooper for 400 coins. And we did pick up this before 1,800 coins. I pick up this, um, this guy here. I don't know why this guy's going for so much, but obviously when we was comparing their price, that we did see him up for 950 goals. I have no idea why when instantly I think, oh my god, that's a sick deal. Why didn't I pick him up? But then the big up for 950 goals. I think we did have my I think it's about 3.2k or 3k somewhere around there. Um, I actually can't remember because I'm actually watching this back. So we do put this up for 3.4k. We even we even triple our coins on that. So pretty much we're always tripping our coins during this episode. Not everyone, but quite a few people. Now pick up this. I think it's Neil Neil right here for I think we pick up about thunder guys. It's about 1.6k, which is a pretty nice deal. This goalkeeper was coming extinct on the market. I have no idea why. He's got really bad stats. Maybe no listen on the market, but maybe if someone wanted to do in their team, that they'll buy mine for 3.1k. And to be honest, it did take quite a while. To but they had to drop the price maybe 1.8k and he sold instantly for about 1.8k now I did pick up this Vine Red Hair guy for 900 coins you know what a pretty, a pretty nice deal I can't remember what the chips were on the market that I this this is always a, a, a over commentary. It, it's it, it's not a live commentary because um doing this it has to be a overcome so I did pick up what so we did this up for about 2.4k yet again we almost uh, tripled on the way I think no we just 
almost tripled it, we didn't triple but we almost did, but uh, he had like a couple more hundred coins and we almost tripled our profit. So then pick up this guy for 2.6k, yeah it's the same person that we picked up for 950 coins, so they're pretty nice though. But then um, that is um, that, so as everyone did sell during that episode. So hope you guys did enjoy this episode, if you did please smash that thumbs up, subscribe if you are brand new on there. So yeah, as you everyone did so, we did make some nice profit on that. So yeah guys, that is it. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, please drop a, drop a subscribe. Like this video for brand new on there. Other than that, I've been Charlie CG Game here. And I'll see you guys later on. Peace.